hello 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 welcome back to my channel i'm samantha winona this is winona reads so firstly if you haven't been here before welcome this is my book channel where i discuss things i've read things i want to read stuff of the like sometimes i do post videos about family trips and you know weekend vlogs but most of it is book oriented i've been a little mia lately for that i apologize between the holiday season and just um a little bit of seasonal mood issues there's just been a lot going on i have not filmed at all i did try to film this announcement a couple weeks ago and just didn't like the quality of the video didn't like the lighting so i didn't post it I want to post it today because, drum roll please, I wrote a poetry collection called Thoughts on a Shelf by Samantha Haydock. It is available on Amazon. I published it first as a Kindle ebook and I was like, you know what? It would be fun to have a paperback copy and a lot of people have been liking the paperback better just to have a physical copy. So that's been really cool. But I wanted to make this announcement because today I released the second collection. It is available for pre-order on Amazon. It is Thoughts Suspended and the cover art will be posted soon. These are collections. So this first one, Thoughts on the Shelf, the cover was designed by Lucia at Lavender Logos. She is a family friend who has done a lot for me for YouTube and other things. She's just been all over a huge help and I would not have been able to do this specifically without her. So definitely check out her Instagram page for any, you know, advertising or logo needs. Sorry, I'm listening to my kids downstairs. They're talking about the Grinch. So this is a collection. <clears throat> this first one I started back when I was in high school. I used to just write on like scraps of paper and I kept like a folder. I have, uh, I'm embarrassed to say this because this is going to tell you how old I am, but I had a floppy disk, which I actually still have, uh, full of poems. Um, and I would just kind of write them on anything like computer paper. I saved it all. So there was one day I was cleaning out my closet and I was like, you know what? I want to go through and read and it took me so long to not only make can i help you i don't know where that train of thought went so excuse me for the interruption from my kids that if you haven't been on my channel before is something that is always caught on film they don't know boundaries they're very young and that's fine but i am quite normally interrupted in 90% of the time I lose my track of thought so anyway um, I would keep things on scraps of paper and so yeah so I was cleaning out my closet and I was like I'm gonna sit and read and half of it didn't either make sense or the scribble was so small but a lot of it I took and kind of edited and shortened and you know just revamped it into something that would make more sense to me now um and then some of it is also just recent stuff that i kind of had a word in mind or a phrase and just built off of that and towards the end of this one it felt a little bit like rushed like i was just so excited i wanted to get the collection out i wanted to you know present it to everybody and just say like i'm really proud of my work so i really feel more connected You know, I thought this announcement would be rather fast, but so the second collection is something that was created all on the computer. I kept a like an ongoing journal on Microsoft Word, so I didn't actually write any of this new collection down. And this is all like more recent stuff, more recent thoughts, more recent verbiage, just a different I don't want to say a different tone because it has a lot of the same stuff as this collection. It just kind of takes it a step further and I feel like it's a little bit more adult in the way that it's read so yeah that was my announcement <laughs> I wrote two books 
and this one is actually published it's available on kindle it is available on paperback it is an, i don't think i'm going to do hardcover just expense wise then the second one is like i said available for pre-order the date we have in mind is January 14th for release. The cover should be available soon, if not this weekend, definitely next week. And then the paperback for that will probably be the end of this month, probably be the end of this month. I'm so excited that I'm just skipping words in my sentences now. So yeah, I wrote two books. It's poetry. It's something that I wanted to have an outlet in. Like I said, there's been just a lot going on this year and well past year it's 2023 now uh but 2022 was definitely one of the hardest if not the hardest year and so i really am proud that i had something positive come out of it and then really proud more so i think of this next collection so definitely stay tuned for that i'm gonna leave all the links down below please not only read the book and tell me what you think hopefully good vibes rate it it's on goodreads too um you can read it on goodreads or amazon uh you can buy kindle i think there's going to be a promotion where if you already have kindle unlimited you can get it for free or it will be starting soon um and then like i said you can pre-order the second one i'm so excited so um yeah thank you for staying tuned and i'm thinking that I'm going to have more time to start creating content, I'm feeling a little bit better as far as like a mindset of getting back into this. So I, you know, it wasn't ideal to take so much time off. And like I said, last year was just a really hard year and I'm excited to get back into things and get back into the hobbies that make me really happy. So cheers. It's Friday. Have a good weekend. Keep reading. Go buy my book and like and subscribe. See you soon. Bye.